I, I see myself as being a household name in the culinary world okay. in Nigeria, beyond Nigeria. So um, the first thing I did, I think last, last week I did, I did, I cooked for charity and it was sponsored by PayPal. Mm -hmm. ne um, in the next few weeks, my show is coming out very soon. Very, very soon. Your own personal show? Yes. Okay, um, so a lot of love is out there, but what are the comments that you received from some of your fans or people about Big Brother that has made you or uh, put you on the hot spots? What are the things they've said to you that you'd be like, mm. right now maybe I don't want to be associated with Big Brother? Um, really, um, Big Brother comes, we understand, we understand it comes with uh, this, that part of it. Mm. You, know, some, you would see some hate comments. You would also obviously receive them, mm. as well as you receive the love. It also comes with some things that yeah. you see and you know. But whatever the case may be, I don't think I would. Don't, I want to say I don't want to be associated with the brand because I am Beyonce here. I am sitting right here, and I'm sitting right here because of Big Brother. If I was cooking in one kitchen, you wouldn't call me. It depends. <laughs> it depends on how good the food is. <laughs> you know, I am sitting right here. People are watching me. People are listening to me. Mm -hmm. And Big Brother has provided, giving me that platform to showcase who I am. If, if you and your wife in the future yes. um, give birth to a child, a son, a yeah. daughter, Big Brother is still happening. Yes. Would you encourage your child to go into Big Brother? Uh, I, I don't think, I, there wouldn't be any reason not to. If, that's, that's the child's choice. You know, uh, when, when I told my mom I was, I, I was going to Big Brother, mm -hmm. She was like, that is your choice. You and know? What, what has As your an mom, adult. Did your mom see everything you did in Big Brother? Did they give her excess of what you <laughs> did in Big Brother? What did I do? Ah, <laughs> Mr. Musu. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, did your mom get to see every aspect of you in Big Brother? Um, yes, I have really not spoken to her. You don't really speak to anybody much. No, no, your no, girlfriend, no, your mom. No, 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 no. no. I've, we've not spoken about that aspect. That, that is why. If I mean. she saw what you and T-Boss did... Did, yeah, see, did, I'm I, I believe I believe the Big Brother show is um, above eighteen. Yeah, yeah. No kids allowed. Yeah, we entered into the show knowing that there was a possibility these things might. Happen. But what about your own personal convictions? Are there things that you morally do not want to do? That's my question to you now. When, when I'm, I'm picturing your mother yeah. watching Big Brother. Yeah. I'm picturing her saying, "Oh, this is what he's done," and she's proud to actually mention it to her her, her, her friends yes. in church or whatever the case might be or in a party and say, I'm point, that is my son. Do you think everything you did in Big Brother will make your mother point her finger to you and say, that is my son? Well, just, I, I, <laughs> okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Is it, that okay. is my son or that's my you son? Know, you, know, you know, our problem in this country is... Will your mother, what will your yeah, mother... Yeah, this is what I want to say, is uh, we, are be, we, are, we, are, we are kind of hypocritical. We're hypocritical. Yes. We might say, oh, what this guy is doing is bad. It's terrible. Why would he do this on national TV, you know? And mm. you, we all know that <laughs> in, in our, in, in where people don't see us, we know we do worse. Okay. Talking about doing worse, let's put a pin in that. Um, Mayonnaise is still here. <laughs> Beyonce is still here. We'll be back after the break on the final lap and uh, find out um, some other aspects of the Big Brother house and what he thinks right here on Robin Mines. Quite an interesting hot seat we have here today. Stick around. The conversation is still going on. Hashtag Robin Mines. You can tweet at us at TV or on Instagram at Television. Uh, we have uh, Mr. Mionse in the building still with us. Mr. Mosu, let me put it that way. Um, what does your name even mean? Um, I'm sure you get this mayonnaise joke every time. Yes, so. yes. Uh, <laughs> um, it means know your God. Know your God. Yes. You're from which part of Ohio? Badagri. Lagos State, Badagri, um, Ego. Okay. Mother is? Mom is Lagos Ekbe. And that is? Le, um, Lagos Badagri. Where's, where's that in this picture? Uh, Your father? Yes. What? Oh, pass. Okay, yeah, just went to, for, for the sake. And how, how old were you when this happened? Uh, while I was, before I entered the house, was when he passed on. Okay. Um, I mean, not everybody, everybody knows that. Uh, condolences um, on, on that. Did that have any impact on how yes, you behaved did. in it the did. house? It did. Um, sometimes I, I was more into myself, you know. Um, I couldn't attend his burial. You know, while I was in the house, yeah. it was being buried. 
you know, so, you know, it sort of did throw me off my game a little. And would, um, what, what, I mean, what do you think you would have done differently in the house if he was alive? Ah, my, my, that is my number one fan, you know, he's always like, you know, I feel like, um, not like I did not get enough support okay, going into yeah. the house, you know, but, you know, having to think that, you know, so, you know, you, one of your number one fan is, is dead, you know, and you might not even get to see him again. It's, Sorry it's, about that. And how, how have you handled it outside Big Brother now? Uh, or has it just taken a back seat for now? No, no back seat, man. <laughs> no back seat, man. I'm going to pay my last, con uh, my last uh, respect. respect to him. Yeah. As well, okay. Let's let's touch on the issue of um, why Big Brother was being shot in Essex. I mean, while you're in the house, there was a lot of back and forth. The federal government asking why it was shot in, in, in South Africa. Um, toppled with that, there's the morality issue of what Big Brother represents. Um, anybody watching Big Brother for the first time who is not African or who is not Nigerian will be like, "Oh, is this what happens in the house?" Um, what What's your take on that? Do you think they have any right to to to, to search a spotlight on on Big Brother? Or they should just focus on other things. Okay. Uh, why? Why was it? Um, why did the show take place in South Africa? Mm. I believe um, the, the organizers of the show they they went through it thoroughly, and they realized going going to South Africa, flying most of the, everyone to South Africa would have been cheaper than doing it here. I feel like they thought it would have been a logistical nightmare doing it here. We don't want to have a show whereby it's going on, and <laughs> you know, you know, some people. Light goes off, but you, you know, know, but the truth because is that do, do, of... people are watching. I've had fans from Germany call me. That means they were watching. Mm. So I, it's safe to say the world was watching. So do we want to take that risk of, you know, projecting projecting us in in such image? You know, talking about can, image that we can't actually, How you know, power. organize hmm. as something as small as Big Brother. Okay. Um, but if, if you had, I mean, if, if you're invited to the presidency now and you're told, okay, name three things that should make us not cancel Big Brother. As you mean, the federal government is on this side and you're on this side and they have the power to pull the plug on Big Brother and they say, yeah. give us three reasons why we shouldn't. What would you say? Okay, to start with, um, Big Brother promotes talent for we the housemates. This is, I'm going to go in stages. Yeah. For we the housemates, everyone had talents. Every, I'm a chef. You realize we had so many entertainers. Mm. These are budding entertainers that are not known. You know, um, TTT is a dancer. I was also an entertainer. You know, everyone had something to do. Okay. And this is, a, this, this, this is a platform to showcase these people, you know, putting, out, putting them out there. Also, now, we are out there. This has a multiplier effect mm. on, in, on the economic situation. I'm a chef. If I happen to own a restaurant, I'm going to employ people. Okay. Same with Cocoa Eyes. Same with, with mm. so many people. Mm. If they, through this, plat this platform, they're able to employ more people, to create more opportunities. Mm. This is the second reason. And the third reason. <laughs> is what? <laughs> I should just leave it at two for now. <laughs> well... Is the third reason, third reason explicit? We, 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 are, we, we, need, we need to cool off sometimes. You know? We need to cool off sometimes. <laughs> you know? I, I pray that's not what everybody remembers you. But uh, Beyonce, well done to, to you. Um, you, did, you did a good job. Wish you all the best in your future endeavors um, post Big Brother. And uh, wait to see how, how the game unfolds. You've just had, you've lost a chance to win for 25 million. I just told you to give me a name of who would win and you couldn't. Um, it's been quite fun. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen at home. Join us same time next week, 3 p.m. right here for Robin Minds. I am Oscar Onyinson. Have a wonderful week ahead. Bye-bye.